Good evening and welcome to a CNews update. In tonight's news, environmentally sustainable living has now become more attainable with an international project inspiring local change. Californian youth development and energy efficiency leader Jody Pincus has arrived in Australia to share her free home energy audit project with a difference. There's lots of different things you can do in order to make your home more efficient. It will save you energy as well as <coughs> lower greenhouse gas emissions, which is the hot topic. Ms Pincus is committed to educating the public on sustainability, hiring and training local youth and reducing greenhouse gas emissions. She is in Australia to host a series of workshops aimed at encouraging interested stakeholders to develop a successful home energy audit program that will engage local young Australians. Youth go into the home, they do a home energy audit, they install the compact fluorescent light bulbs for free, they install efficient flow shower heads and aerators, they educate the customer and all of that is free. The added bonus of a youth training and education initiative will mean that young people can develop skills in home energy auditing whilst creating opportunities for future employment. You're training youth and you're giving them an employment opportunity in a field that's about to explode. Mark Daniels from the Brotherhood of St Lawrence believes that such projects provide structure and completeness to the lives of disengaged youth that in essence a paid job is a way out of poverty. And we're finding that about 70% of the people who start in our community enterprises um, get jobs in the open labour market at their conclusion. Young Australians will be encouraged to apply and undertake assessment to obtain one of the paid placements in the employment project. What we're assessing our youth on is their critical thinking skills, their problem solving skills and their ability to present themselves well. So they're learning not only the hard skills about energy efficiency but they're learning how to engage with different clients. Young people are the future in this field so we have to really engage them and bring them into this and create leaders. You can find out more about what sets this successful business model apart from other energy audit programs by logging on to www.risingsunenergy.org.